spaces has two windows one is data editor window and the other is output viewer window defining variables entering data and analysis are done in data editor window after performing the analysis spss automatically displays results in a separate window called output viewer in this video you are introduced to these two windows first look at the data editor window it has two views you can see them at the lower left hand side of the screen one is data view and second is variable view data view is where you enter and view the data variable view is used to define variables and their properties when you are working on spss you need to define variables and their properties first and save the file next spss data file extension is .sav open an existing .sav file and observe the variable view and data view different types of variables are defined in variable view and responses are entered in data view now have a look at spss menu features to review the options listed under each menu move cursor on the menu command and click options are listed down file menu has new open open database read text data close save save as export etc next look at edit menu it includes undo redo cut copy paste insert variables insert cases clear go to case go to variable commands then the next one is view view menu allows you to view status bar toolbars view labels data etc view labels command is used to display raw data or data labels next one is data data allows you to define variable properties copy data properties define dates identify duplicates sort split merge and restructure data then transform transform menu is used to compute count record rank create time series replace missing values and generate random numbers the important one is analyze analyze menu allows you to perform almost all statistical analysis with mouse moves drags drops and clicks beginning from univariate analysis to multivariate analysis all tools are listed in analyze menu graphs graphs include the commands to create various types of a graphs including box plots histograms line graphs and bar charts utilities allow you to list file information which is a list of all variables their labels values locations in the data file and type next add-ons add-ons are programs that can be added to the base spss package you probably don't have access to any of those window can be used to select which window you want to view that is data editor output viewer or syntax next comes help help has many useful options including a link to the spss home page a statistics coach and a syntax guide help is an excellent tool to get solutions when you are stuck spss displays statistical analysis results in a separate window called output viewer you can change the properties of the pivot tables you can add background color change font color font style font size alignment borders and printing to change properties double click on the table to select it then click mouse right button from listed commands click on table properties and edit the properties of the table 